everyone, Adrienne Everhart, your dating and relationship coach. I am so happy to be here on Everhart TV, which is my private coaching television channel. I have created this for women who are really wanting to learn how to use their feminine energy to connect deeply to a man and build a loving, long-lasting relationship that leads to marriage. And if marriage isn't your thing, then some sort of little commitment ceremony where you can let the whole world know that you and this man are tied together. Today, I wanna to talk about what you do when a man has asked you out on a date but yet he's disappeared. So in the online dating world, this happens quite a bit. From my clients, I hear about how a man will say, hey, I wanna ask you out for Friday, or I wanna take you out this weekend, what do you think? And the girl goes, oh, that would feel lovely. So she's using one of her feeling statements that would feel so lovely, she says. And then she writes to me on Thursday and says, I haven't heard from him, what should I do? I kind of want to go to this concert with my girlfriends, but I haven't heard from him and I really want to date him. So I'm going to tell you how to eliminate this as a potential problem in your dating life. Okay. So the first thing you want to do is if a man asks you out and says, Hey, you know, I'd really like to take you out sometime. You say, Oh, that would feel lovely. What day did you have in mind? Or what time were you thinking? So this does two things. It lets the man know that you have a lot more to do than just sit around and wait around for his call and when he's gonna ask you out on a date. You can even follow up if he goes, well, I don't know yet. I don't know what day I wanna, you know, I don't know yet. You can say, okay, because I keep my weekend really full. I do lots of fun stuff on the weekend and it would feel so great to get together and you let him know, I'm not just gonna sit here and idly wait for you to call and make plans with me. The second thing it tells him is that you have a rich and full juicy life going on. You're not just, you know, sitting around at home waiting to see what happens to you this weekend or during the week. You actually have a lot of wonderful things going on in your life. You're an amazing lady. So I want you to make sure that this is all true <laughs> and make sure that you're keeping your life rich, full, and juicy. And please do use those tips to avoid the man asking you out, but not really making the effort to make that date, set that time to take you out. Here's part two of this, which is you wanna have a confirmation. Now, if you're the type of person that you need a confirmation or if this man is new to you and you're not really sure, is he gonna keep his word? Is he gonna take me out this weekend like he said? You know, and he said, yeah, okay, Friday at five, you know, I'll, I'll meet you downtown for drinks at such and such a place. And it's Friday at two o'clock and you haven't had any sort of confirmation. So here's how you wanna avoid that. Let's go back to our original script, which is the man says to you, hey, I'd, I'd like to take you out this weekend sometime, or I'd like to take you out sometime. And you say, lovely, that would feel really amazing. I would feel really happy to do that, whatever it is that you feel. And then you follow up with, what time were you thinking? Or what day were you thinking? And if you're available that day, you say, great. Oh, I'm excited to get together Friday at five. Sometimes I've been on, I've had dates online where the guy doesn't show up and it's felt really disappointing. You can say this, it's vulnerable. It's you being vulnerable. Or you can just say, you know, I'm really the type of person that it feels good to get a confirmation before a date. What do you think? And so you let him know that a confirmation feels good to you. So I'm not really for reaching out to the man, you know, first, I like to give the man as much opportunity as you can to be in his masculine energy take action and call you to confirm the date. So wait about as long as you feel comfortable waiting. And if he doesn't confirm the date, that's when you wanna go ahead and reach out to him and say, hi, feeling so excited about Friday night at six, just making sure we're still on. And then you wait to get that confirmation. All right, ladies, I hope this will help you avoid some flaky guys out there on the uh, World Wide Web and the dating websites and in real life as well. I hope this will help you find men who want to be in their masculine energy, make a date with you, stick to it, and show up and take you out and have a great time. All right, please feel free to come and meet me and learn more about me at everheartcoaching.com or my Instagram channel. I hope to hear from you soon. Bye.